Well, my friends, welcome to the Big O Show. Be happy. Anyway, Bud Dig, the company that I was complaining about finding the bluish silver, look like plastic or metal shavings in the ham, the company Bud Dig, B U D D I G, left a comment below my video today. Yesterday I called the uh, USDA, which is United States Department of Agri Agriculture and all you could get was a machine and all it would tell you is you can listen to these nine different selections about foods that's already been recalled there was nowhere to leave a message and i called the sullivan county sheriff uh sullivan county sheriff department i called the sullivan county health department same thing the lady put me in contact with the uh, sullivan county health department i called was in kingsport tennessee she gave me a number to the bluntville tennessee uh uh, health department, which is Bluntville is the county seat of Sullivan County, even though Kingsport's a bigger city The Bluntville is the county seat. So I called them. I left a message. Nobody never got back in touch with me But today I looked on my video about 30 minutes ago. We looked on my comment section on YouTube and Bud Dig the company Straight from the company and left a comment below my video So they got in touch with me because I had that guy kind of got disheartened. I'm like, well, I'm not gonna keep talking to these computers or answer machines so I didn't call Bud Dig because they closed at 5 p.m. and I looked on my video about I don't know 30 minutes ago about 20 minutes ago and uh, they had left a comment and said they would uh, Bud Dig said they sorry about the the problem said they would address the uh, situation with the plant managers so that was nice of them and you know people make mistakes people a month ago, a month ago I went up here to Hardee's with a coupon and got a Hardee's uh, sausage and gravy biscuit you know uh, you get the little plastic container with your sausage gravy and then you get a whole biscuit in one little styrofoam uh, container well when I opened it up my gravy was, was in, in the container and the biscuit looked good but guess what was laying lying between the biscuit and the container of gravy a long brown hair and and uh, I had already ate one biscuit when I brought it home but that's why I'm a very analytical person I pay attention to food you know you should because I mean it, anything could be in your food when you open it because people prepare it you know nobody's perfect so you know that was I thought that was nice of them to contact me just letting everybody know they did contact me they left a comment below my video and they also have a YouTube channel they have 900 925 subscribers and I subscribed I think it made them 926 about to their channel but I, I don't buy a lot of processed meat I usually buy fresh meat sliced from the deli it doesn't have all that preservatives on it. But anyway, letting you know what happened. Thanks for watching. Share my videos. If you like it, give me a thumbs up. If you don't like it, give me a thumbs down. But be sure to share my videos if you like them. And please subscribe to my channel if you have it already. It's the Big O Show. What you see is what you get. On this channel, I'm going to be doing reviews and blogs. Restaurant reviews, item reviews product reviews and blogs i got a lot to talk about i got a big mouth people and a big brain is that funny to you to me it's funny to me people big o's out thanks for watching i'll see you in the next video